I just wanted to share a quick tip uh, as I get closer to finishing this mini quad build. And this is related to configuring your Turney G9X uh, for thro the throttle reverse feature. So this is actually something that you'll notice if I give it throttle, it behaves as expected. And when I was originally configuring my NASA and my APM boards, I ran into a problem with uh, the throttle reverse feature. And so I wanted to share kind of how that works, how you set it up, and just make you aware of uh, the setting and how you configure it. As I was doing ESC calibration for this mini quad build, I'd gone in and created a new uh, model profile. I call it mini. And so once you set everything up or give your profile a name, you'll go down to stick set. And so in most cases, definitely in my case, I fly in a mode two configuration with the throttle on the left. So you go ahead and hit that. Now here's where it's interesting. So if you're to hit menu, you're actually saying, yes, I want to throttle reverse versus hitting exit. So by hitting menu, I'm actually accepting and saying, yes, I want to throttle reverse. So let's watch what happens. And so you'll see that now the down position is 100% uh, throttle. And so uh, under normal circumstances, you're probably not you know, connected to your receiver and have your uh, ESCs powered up when you're doing this, but I just wanted to demonstrate what happens. Okay, now you see that my throttle is reversed based on that model profile, but what's even more confusing and what I had done originally when I didn't understand that menu setting is I'd gone into the reverse menu, and so you'll see that I'm still reversed. If I go down to throttle, I can reverse again. So now it's like a double reverse makes uh, a normal throttle. So you can tell that I'm good to go there. The key is going, when you're setting up your model profile, just go down here in the stick set and really just understand that once you select your mode, hitting menu says yes, you want to reverse the throttle and hitting exit means no. So now my throttle's up, down, and we're good to go, just as you would expect. So I realized that was pretty counterintuitive. If you're familiar, I'm running the stock firmware for the Turner G9X, which is not the most intuitive and my plan is to upgrade to ER9X but uh, hopefully that helps you guys understand uh, how throttle reversing works. It, it definitely took me a while to figure that out and I'd actually run across it again when I was uh, doing this mini build as I was doing some testing in my ESC calibration. So I hope that was useful and stay tuned. I'm currently uh, getting my ESCs calibrated and then I'll be working on uh, configuring the multi-wee board. So thanks for watching.